Well, thank you for coming to Mar-a-Lago, the greatest venue on the planet. Very nice, by the way, the bride, very beautiful. Not as hot as Ivanka, but uh, still pretty good. So you did, you did nice work. Uh, whatever your name is, I don't know who the hell you are. But anyway, uh, our country is going to hell. And uh, remind me not to have any more Diet Cokes, okay? They go into my head. But uh, the country totally sucks, but I want to say... Uh, the bridesmaids over there, very nice. Not, no, not the big one. You can step aside. You're right. Yes, you, the blonde. Very nice. We would like to talk to you later about a possible position with the Trump organization, okay? But uh, obviously, you're lucky to be having the wedding here. So you're welcome. And, uh, you know, I think somebody's uncle was talking before I overheard uh, as a Biden supporter. So. We are currently urinating all over his luggage. We got some of our great staff to do that. But, you know, we're trying to save the country. Okay, I have Sydney Powell right now arguing the case at a food court, and I think she's won over uh, the Sabaros cashier. So I think we're gonna get a very good judgment soon. Uh, we're gonna take back the country. Wait, I gotta say, okay, no, no it's, would you tell the bride to stop? You're not, you're not pretty enough to, you know, make this about you. Just stop. If you would mind, if you could just leave, I'll, you can have the dance a little bit later. Thank you. Security, please take the bride out of here. I'm talking. So not you though, bridesmaid. We want you to stay here. Thank you. And uh, father of the bride, you know, you tried, but she's no Ivanka. Believe me, during that first dance, you know, father-daughter dance, it was, uh, Let's just say we were at full attention. But the country's going to hell. You're welcome for the venue. Because of the uncle who supports Sleepy Joe, we're raising the prices on everybody's room. So you're welcome. Have a nice night, and uh, we'll see what happens.